What's up, Mr. Parker here, and I'm here to review a movie that uh, I requested to review, and when it came, I was like, wow. I just, it looked really strange. It's a bunch of short films by this director. I've never heard of the director before I saw this case, but after seeing the case and doing a little reading on it, I just had to watch him. Uh, it's called Solar Anus Cinema. With a name like that, you gotta watch it. I can't show you the back because there's nudity, but uh, I'm going to run down what the... Uh, shorts are there's about eight shorts on here uh, ranging from anywhere from uh, confusing disturbing disgusting and hilarious uh, the first uh, short is a uh, tro uh, traumata and it's basically just a beat-up girl kind of like in a photo shoot and it's only a couple minutes long so I was like what is this and the next one was organ Molly and uh, that one basically is a girl rolling around naked nude and doing stuff just typical, kind of weird stuff, but uh, she's just a, kind of like a model shoot, kind of just bizarre. And then uh, towards the end, she starts like uh, rubbing her face on this glass and blood out of her mouth and stuff, and kind of a little Lucifer Valentine-ish. And then uh, self-contained is where it starts to get strange. It's actually, I believe, the guy's wife, and she's in a uh, saran wrap completely, her whole body. And as it progresses, her... Uh, uh, her sexual organs begin to be show, shown. And that's when I was like, ah, oh, hmm, that's pretty strange. And uh, Slaughtered Pigtails is the one that really, uh, it's a short kind of a view from a killer or from something on the ground as you're watching someone be murdered. It's kind of strange. And here's where it really picks up and gets intense. Uh, convulsion, expulsion. That is the one right here on the cover. Uh, this girl, she wanders in, she's painted white, and she starts twitching. She's really twitchy and everything, it's kind of bizarre. And uh, lo and behold, uh, she just starts, this shit just starts falling out of her mouth. She's really twitchy, it's kind of creepy, and all these liquids, like shit, starts falling out of her mouth. And you look down and there's blood, and she lifts up, and her, her vagina looks like it's covered in blood in the area. And uh, I don't want to really go into what happens too much, but uh, anyways, it, it involves shitting out blood that's all I can really say about it it's really insane and it's only about five minutes but it's an intense crazy five minutes blood spewing out of her anus onto the floor it's so disgusting but weird and ugh, kind of disturbing and then we have a uh, runaway which was kind of like a bizarre Egyptian it took the song runaway but it seemed like an Egyptian type or Arabic, more like it. I believe the director's Arabic. Arabic kind of a musical thing to it. Uh, that one I thought was probably one of the most uh, tame ones of the bunch. And then we get uh, Patient, who's a, about a girl. She's kind of like rolling around on a couch and all sorts of weird stuff. And the bandages are coming off. It's really weird. And we get Spoiled, which is the one that I actually, like a little girl, it's been a long time since I've done this. I did do it during some of Lucifer Valentine, but like a little girl, I was hiding behind my pillow like, oh my god, no. And it basically shows this girl, she sits there, smiles, pigtails, opens up a little purse that's spoiled, and uh, takes a bite of a pear, or a peach, or a plum. And you're like, eh, eh, and then she takes another bite of it and falls out of her mouth. And you're like, okay. And then she starts shoving gummy worms in her mouth. And pretty much it turns into a nasty uh, uh, buffet of her shoving food in her mouth, spitting it out, puking it out, not puking, but spitting it, and just letting it fall all out of her mouth and everywhere. Uh, and through those little shorts, I was wondering what the grand finale was going to be. I was entertained throughout. I was disturbed. I was kind of disgusted. I was a little, the, you know, it's strange stuff, and they were all really pretty cool made and all different in their own way. And the last one came on, it was the Amateurs. And it was about, the other ones are only running from two to five minutes long. This one ranges for 45, 50 minutes. It's the bulk of the short. And what happened was, I was actually amazed at it, the way this movie took. I mean, the shorts took. It actually was a comedy. And I caught myself laughing hysterically. Basically, it's a few guys, uh, a few Arab guys who, uh, basically go out and try to make a porno, make a quick buck, and uh, it's two Arab guys, and I think he's European, but they go try to make a buck, and everything just goes wrong, all the people they interview, all the people they want to do it, uh, even the guy, the director's just having a hell of a time getting his own actors to even do it, originally they, they uh, have a guy who comes in who's like an artist, him and his girlfriend, and he, want, he keeps talking about fish, and they're like, okay, get the hell out of here, 
and it progresses and all all sorts of crazy stuff happens from them trying to get a girl to poop in a hilarious way to uh, a crackhead getting in there to people feeling sorry for one of the girls it's just uh, a girl comes in with an eye patch all sorts of funny shenanigans and it, it, it's really funny and I caught myself laughing a few times uh, but this movie is very it's definitely for adults I mean but there's this uh, DVD here and all these shorts right here are all different and show a wide variety of the director's works. I was really, really happy with it. I liked all the shorts on here, uh, especially uh, I really enjoyed Convulsion Expulsion just because it was so sick. And uh, Slaughtered Pigtails was cool. And The Amateurs was a really, really great comedy that was about some amateurs trying to make a porno and all the stuff that could possibly go wrong. I would really recommend this one if you, anyone who likes short films or experimental films or... Uh, kind of gross films even uh experimental films is more like it but uh it's solar anus cinema uh crazy title i'm not going to be able to say this uh guy's name so i'm not even gonna try, try. I, i'll try usama alashabia i got the, see i failed miserably but anyways uh check this out it has one two three four five six seven eight nine ten shorts on here and they're all worth your time and they're all something different so uh that's the dvd and uh thank you for watching have a good one bye Right now? But she's skirting, man. Just stop. Come on. Okay. Do the same. Come on. Take off her dress. Okay, let, me, let me help you. Hold on a second. What happened to your eye? I poked it with a pool cue. 
Really? Yeah. Uh, how did you do that? 